Hi, my name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. All right guys, I have a very appealing, low mileage 2009 Shelby GT500. Uh, no longer are the GT500s with a manual transmission. True to its uh, originality. So pick up this low mile one while you can. Uh, this is a low mile vehicle coming in with 6,685 original miles on it. It's in fantastic shape inside and out. So let's take a look at it. Now guys, real quick before we get into the rest of the video, if you guys have been enjoying our YouTube videos, make sure you subscribe to our channel. If you click the bell icon, you'll get notified every time a new one gets posted. You don't want to miss out. we got a lot of killer inventory coming in and out of this place. They go just as quick as they come in. So if you want to be the first to see it, beat everyone else, make sure to click the bell. For the full photo shoots and write-up descriptions, you can visit volocars.com. There you can study the specs. You can take a look at our full studio shots of these vehicles. Uh, we have close-up shots. You have in-depth uh, interior, exterior, engine bay, underneath the vehicles. And it's all on the website, volocars.com. There's a couple hundred, both modern muscle and classic cars. They're all for sale. Uh, it's highly addicting. I'm on the site all the time looking at these awesome rides, so make sure to check it out. All right, let's get into it. Technical difficulty. All right, so this is finished in the black with the red over the top uh, roof stripes. The car itself is in very nice condition. Uh, the paint's glossy, it's smooth. I haven't seen any touch up or anything like that. Uh, it shows itself really nicely. They did add a lot of chrome appearances uh, around the trim and stuff. It's a bunch of chrome overlays on it, as you'll see as we get into the car further. Uh, it does have a shorty antenna on it as well. The wheels were changed out. They're not the originals. Uh, it looks like they have some Shelby chrome wheels that were added. The wheels are 18 inches in the front and the rear, so they are squared. They're wrapped in a nice Goodyear Eagle F1 tire. They have plenty of tread on them. Uh, this has front Brembo disc brakes, performance brakes, and then just regular disc brakes in the rear. Obviously, they are part of the GT500 performance package. Uh, has the GT500 side door badging on it as well. Uh, I love the black on the red with the, the, wide, the wide red stripes. Uh, just ties in nicely. All the em snake emblems are red as well. So it makes it a very menacing, uh, appealing car. It does have a billet gas cap with the red uh, offset lettering on it. And then, of course, we have the rear side window covers or vents, as you want to call them. This is equipped with the ground effects package. So you get the front spoiler, the lower side skirts as well. Uh, it does have the nice rear wing on it. I love the front ends of these. They're just very iconic. There's nothing like it. They have bright LED uh, fog lights and HID headlights. The lenses are crystal clear on them. The big honeycomb grill in the front, or in the middle I should say, and the lower one. They're in very nice shape. They're not faded or worn out at all. Um, the stripes are very popping on the car, so very nice condition. There's a little curb rash down on the front lip, but that is common. Uh, it's just plastic, so it is replaceable. Underneath the car, guys, uh, it has been well kept. It's been stored in a garage, under a cover, uh, in a climate control facility. So uh, very, very clean underneath. All right, so this does have the, uh, I believe they're billet, but they're the Roush uh, lower lateral arms on it or rear lower control arms. Uh, this does have a solid rear axle, limited slip on it. It has been upgraded to the dual stainless steel to the chrome Ford Racing exhaust tip so it is a ford racing exhaust so that was a factory added option uh, which is nicer dealer installed at the time uh, but underneath again very clean with such low miles it appears just like the rest of the car let's take a look inside all right guys so let's step into this cockpit don't be blinded by the trim but it is chromed out uh, everything has a crim chrome trim overlay on it. Uh, it is removable if you don't care for it, but 
Overall, the condition is in excellent shape. Uh, love the black on the red, two-tone interior. Uh, it matches the outside of the car. It just pops real nicely. It's very, very clean. The seats are in real nice condition, so it has the GT500 uh, with the embossed snake logo on them. They are just the sport bucket seats, not the Recaros. In the center, you have your GT500 uh, Shelby plaque. It appears to be signed by Carol Shelby. I don't know if that's a real signature or not. In the center, uh, we have a short throw shifter with the classic six-speed shift knob ball on it and it's even black with the red stripes so matches the rest of the car uh, even the floor mats they're premium carol shelby floor mats and they're black with the dual red striping on them so very common theme in here everything ties together nicely this does have the upgraded shaker 1000 stereo system on it obviously you have your climate control knobs in the center there i believe it's a six disc changer cd changer on it as well uh, and then you have your uh, trip settings up top, traction control button. The dash is in very nice shape. Same with the door panels. All the leather is fantastic. There's no cracking or brittleness anywhere. Still smells like new in here. Uh, the rear seats, I don't think anyone's ever sat back there. They look brand spanking new. So very nice condition inside and out. The headliner is nice and tight. We do have two sets of keys and fobs that go with it so that's nice in the trunk area guys you can pop it with the key fob we have a matching carol shelby black with the dual red stripe uh, trunk cover as well as a premium car cover with the snake logo very nice bag it fits in nicely easy to open and close it even has a handle two handles actually we have the dual subwoofer system, part of the Shaker 1000, so this thing stays bumping all the time. You can play your favorite jams. Underneath, the carpeting is in really nice condition. Uh, all the trim, too. There's no scratches on the plastic. All the weather stripping is nice and soft. There's no brittle or cracking or anything like that. Uh, still smells new. So, very nice condition. Moving on to the engine bay. This has the 5.4 liter V8 supercharged, pushing 500 horsepower from the factory. It is a six-speed manual. So again, guys, get them while they're out there because they're obviously not making any more of them. We have the nice Ford Racing blower on top. Uh, I love these engine bays. They just make them look very appealing. You have the rear strut or the uh, sway Strut tower bar, excuse me, not rear, the front, obviously. It does have some nice billet caps that were added. Uh, it does have the Shelby billet caps as well on the fluid reservoirs and the engine oil cover as well. Uh, these engines, obviously hand-built from the SVT, so the plaque with the engine builder's names are on that right-hand side. Uh, this does have an additional Moroso uh, coolant reservoir tank that's finished in a polished aluminum. It's in very nice condition. Just adds to the appealing or appearance of this car. It is very appealing, so very nicely done. Everything's super clean on it. Uh, it shows like it only has 6,000 miles. Instead of the hood prop, uh, they did add some nice um, Mustang Racing Technology hood struts, so that's nice. You're able to just open the hood, Put it up and you don't have to fumble around. Uh, you can work on it hands-free or have your hands full when you open the hood. guys that was my impression on our 2009 Shelby GT500 and if you want a nice collectible car with low miles uh, you can't beat these cars for the performance you get at the price uh, there's really nothing like it so they come in at a 
really nice price range with uh, plenty of power to have fun. Uh, and you can add some upgrades to these without breaking the bank. So there's kind of a best of both worlds to it. Uh, but again, this one only has 6,685 original miles on it, guys. It's in really, really nice shape. The paint is super slick on it. Love the black on the red. Uh, just the whole combo through, in and out. Looks really, really nice. If you guys are interested in purchasing this car, you can visit volocars.com. Uh, there, if you click the Buy It Now button, it'll secure a refundable deposit on this car. Uh, it'll shoot us an email. We can help set up financing and shipping that way. It's super easy. We can get this thing right to your driveway uh, for all your neighbors to be jealous of. But volocars.com. Or you can call us, ask for me, Caleb. I'd be more than happy to talk over the car some more with you. I can also help set up financing and shipping that way as well. Thanks for checking it out.